Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ankush. Today's video will be based on the performance tuning. So in the performance, uh, there is uh, one activity which we always do. We called it as a rebuilding of index. Rebuilding of index. So basically what we do and why we are doing this uh, rebuilding of index. Okay. This is also many times has been asked in the interview also you know like uh, let's say you have one table is there and in this table you have huge amount of data is there and this data is related to let's say country we have a different different countries are available let's say you have data available related to the usa india china and i'm in a situation where i need to find out the data related to the india so my query will be like select star from country where country name equals to India. So if I fire this command and assume that we don't have any indexes over here, what will happen? It will go into the full table scan, full table scan. What is mean by full table scan? It will like it will try to find out the record in full table. So for that, you know, you are using the indexes and we can create an index in based on the multiple columns and there are different different type of indexes are there that we are going to learn in the next video. But at this time, at this point, what you can do, you can just subscribe to my channel so that whenever I'll upload new video, you'll get the first notification. Okay. Now, why we are doing the rebuilding of indexes? What does it mean? Now, what happened? Let's say this country table. On this country table, you are loading too much of data. Means you are inserting too much of data. You have added. So, there are operation we are performing like you are inserting huge amount of data into this table. You are deleting some tape, deleting some data from this table or you are some updating some data also from this table. What will happen as soon as you make some changes into this table your indexes your index will not get changed automatically let's say i have one record here the address is 100 and this address available into my this index table which is a mapping table basically which is saying that on this 100 we have india record is available now what happened like suddenly you deleted this hundred location you mark this row deleted now as soon as you delete this record from the actual table your index will have still information like boss we have a record available here now this is a problem right so in order to make my index up to date okay with the latest information that time we need to rebuild the index so does this rebuilding the index is an online activity or offline activity and when should we do that what oracle is suggesting that whenever you are rebuilding the index that time that row will be blocked for the certain duration when the rebuilding of index is happening that time it will bl uh, block that row so it is always advised to do the rebuilding of indexes usually in the night time means of business hours we can do that you don't need to shut down the database only the row will get blocked so if any other user is trying to access the same row let's say user 2 is coming and he's saying that boss i want to access the same row he will not be able to get that because your indexes is rebuilding and your row has been blocked so better you do it in off business hours off business hours and when should we try to do rebuilding index again when you are doing some insert update or delete usually the table where we are doing a lot of changes we should not you know do the indexes there will be a table like reporting table where you can definitely go for the indexes and if you are changing the table frequently then you need to go for the rebuilding of indexes 
at least weekly ones at least weekly ones so this is how you know a rebuilding of indexes play an important role there are certain queries are also which will show you whether the indexes needs to be happened or not okay so i hope uh, this idea you must have understood if you have any question queries anything please feel free to put it into the comment section and again if you are looking for real time oracle database training you can reach out to me and if you want to learn this full course is free of cost that's okay you can learn it on my youtube channel again i have a website called learnomade.org there some of the courses are completely free of cost so you can go there go to my website there are some of the courses right now it is free of cost so you can enjoy these courses also okay and there is one more interesting course is there oracle db interview questions which is a paid course you can enroll over here all the real time oracle database interview question i have explained over here along with the answers and you will get the lifetime access thank you please do like subscribe and share this channel bye bye